Hey everybody, how is it going today? <clears throat> today in the Psalms that we are going to read, or that I'm going to read, is Psalm 34. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Of David, when he changed his behavior before Abimelech, so that he drove him out and he went away. Hey, look who's there. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul makes its boast in the Lord. Let the humble hear and be glad. O oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and he answered me, and delivered me from all my fears. Those who look to him are radiant, and their faces shall never be ashamed. This poor man cried, and the Lord heard him. And saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and delivers them. O oh, taste and see the Lord is good. Blessed is a man who takes refuge in him. O oh, fear the Lord, you his saints. For those who fear him have no lack. The young lions suffer want and hunger. But those who seek the Lord lack no good thing. Come, O oh, children, listen to me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord. What man is there who desires life and loves many days that he may see good? Keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking deceit. Turn away from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are toward the righteous and his ears toward their cry. The face of the Lord is against those who do evil to cut off the memory of them from the earth. When the righteous cry for help, the Lord hears and delivers them out of their troubles. The Lord is near to the brokenhearted and saves the crushed in spirit. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivers him out of them all. He keeps all his bones, not one of them is broken. Affliction will slay the wicked, and those who hate the righteous will be condemned. The Lord redeems the life of his servants. None of those who take refuge in him will be condemned. That is today's psalm. And a couple parts here in the middle. On verse 9, O oh, fear the Lord, you his saints, for those who fear him have no lack. And before that in 8, O oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. Can I come on the right timing? It's still recording. Good. Good. <laughs> it's always good to see you here. And in the end, to the Lord redeems the life of his servants. None of those who take refuge in him will be condemned. And that is a, um, it's a beautiful thing because that's, that's part of the part when we talk about resting in Christ, because we know that he will take care of us. Right, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And as we it just got done, um, celebrating Easter, our yeah. risen Lord. She got a new haircut yesterday from her mommy, and she loves it. Still got the length, still got nice, but yeah. But they could shave her head, and it would still look good, wouldn't it, sweetie? No. Look, me, you shaved me, and I still look good, right? Mm, well, she still had that butchy beard. <laughs> It'll come back, don't worry. I'm just letting out all Uncle Rock here. Oh, really? What? Uncle Rock's your brother. Yes. You do look too look look a lot like very much, but if you still had that right there, it'd be good. But if you just kept that down, it would be. I think that's it for today. Good kiss. No, it's too crunchy. He's crunchy. Commentary by my little girl. He's crunchy. So He's everybody. Very, very, very crunchy. So everybody, may the Lord bless you. May he keep you. May he shine in you. May you dwell in his mercies and rest in him, okay? Rest in him. God bless you all. Hmm.